breaking. Presidents and Northern Governor seeks to break up the country middle bet forum. Welcome to, to, to today's news. The National President of Middle Belt Forum, MBF Dr. Beatrice Bogo, Tuesday, warned that Northern Governors are seeking the breakup of Nigeria by their resolve at their cardinal meeting. The power would not shift to the South in 2023. Dr. Pogu, who told Vanguard in Makodi that the position of the Northern Governors was a threat to the unity of the country and a dangerous signal that could threaten the Fed to, to threaten the very foundation of the country. He also reminded them that that they were not speaking for the people of the Middle Belt, who should not be classified as Northerners, as there was nothing like a monolithic North anymore. According to Dr. Pogo, the governors of the North should first and foremost realize that there is nothing like a monolithic North again. Secondly, they should know that the middle belt can never be part of so, can never be part of such a position that is anti people. So they should all hide their faces in shame for saying power will not go to the south in 2023. They should remember that because of what happened to Abiola in 1999, we zoned the presidency to the southwest, not just south. The country has maintained that that rotation so that peace can reign in the country and no part of the country will feel alienated. Therefore, in these situations, for them to insist that presidency should be retained in the north after that zone has completed its eight years tenure in 2023 is a shame. It means they want Nigerians to break up. That is what they are after. They are not lovers of Nigeria. They are the people who hate Nigeria, and it is obvious by the position they took yesterday. But they must realize that the middle bet is not with them because there is no more monolithic north. Even the traditional rulers of the middle bet who were who were invited to the meeting in Kaduna were not with them. They were in attendance and watched what transpired, but I can assure you that their hearts were not there. On the issue of that, we know that Governor Wiki and his Lagos counterpart felt it was not proper for them to generate VAT and get so little. The matter is currently at the apex court, and it is not for anyone to say anything or take a position. At this moment, it is the Supreme Court that will determine the position of the Constitution and the matter will be arrested for good. The National President of Middle Belt Forum has warned that Northern governors are seeking the breakup of Nigeria by their resolve at their cardinal meeting that would not shift to the South in 2023. According to Vanguard, MBF President Dr. Beatrice Bogu described the position of the governors as a threat to the unity of the country and dangerous signal that could threaten the foundation of the country. Dr. Pogu, who told Vanguard in Makodi that the position of the Northern Governors was a threat to the unity of the country and a dangerous signal that could threaten the very foundation of the country. He also reminded he also reminded them that they were not speaking for the people of the Middle Belt, who should not be classified as Northerners, as there was nothing like a monolithic North anymore. According to Dr. Pogo, the governors of the North should first and foremost realize that there is nothing like a monolithic North again. Secondly, they should know that the Middle Belt can never be part of such a position that is anti-people. So they should all hide their faces in shame for saying power will not go to the South in 2023. They should remember that because of what happened to Abiola in 1999, we zone the presidency of the South West, not just South. The country has maintained that rot has maintained that rotation so that peace can reign in the country and no part of the country will feel alienated. Therefore, in this in these situations for them to insist that presidency should be retained in the north after that zone has completed its eight years tenure to, 
in 2023 is a shame. It means they want Nigerians to break up. That is what they are after. They are not lovers of Nigeria. They are they are the people who hate Nigeria. And it is obvious by the position they took yesterday. But they must realize that the middle belt is not with them because there is no more monolithic north. Even the traditional rulers of middle belt who were invited to that meeting in Cardona were not with them. They, they were in attendance and watched what transpired, but I can assure you that their art were not there. On the issue of that, we know that Governor Wiki and his Lagos counterpart felt it was not proper for them to generate VAT and get so little. The matter is currently at the apex court and it is not for anyone to say anything or take a position. At this moment, it is the Supreme Court that will determine the position of the Constitution and the matter will be arrested for good. On the issue of that, we know that Governor Wiki and his Lagos counterparts felt it was not proper for them to generate VAT and get so little. Therefore, in these situations, for them to insist that presidency should be retained in the North after that, after that zone has completed its eight years in tenure in 2023 is a shame. They should remember that because of what happened to Abiola in 1999, we zoned the presidency to the Southwest, not just South. The country has maintained that rotation so that peace can reign in the country and no part of the country will feel alienated. According to Dr. Pogo, the governors of the North should first and foremost realize that there is nothing like a monolithic North again. Secondly, they should know that the Middle Belt can never be part of such a position. That is anti-people. So they should all light their faces in gym for saying power will not go to South in 2023. He also reminded them that they were not speaking for the people of the Middle Belt. We should not be classified as not an ass. And as there was nothing like a monolithic not anymore. Yeah, I have a comment here which is good. People are waking up gradually. And there is another comment here that says, this kind of sittings, open it brings, it brings um, a positive achievement and a positive change to the nation. And this will be the end of our today's news. Thanks for listening and stay tuned.